In a land far, far away, there lived a group of friendly animals in the jungle. There was a playful monkey, a curious rabbit, a strong elephant, a sneaky snake, and a wise owl. They were all great friends and loved to play together in the lush green forest. One sunny day, they decided to go on an adventure to find the biggest fruit they could find. As they were walking through the jungle, they stumbled upon a giant watermelon. It was the biggest watermelon they had ever seen. They all wanted to taste it but they couldn't lift it as it was too heavy. The monkey climbed up the tree to get a better look and shouted down to others. Hey guys, the watermelon is too heavy for us to carry. The rabbit being the curious one asked, What do you mean by heavy? The monkey replied, Heavy means it's really hard to lift because it weighs a lot. The elephant being the strongest of them all tried to lift the watermelon but couldn't do it either. He said, I don't think I can lift it because it's too massive. The snake being the sneaky one slithered up to the watermelon and said, I don't think it's heavy, it's just big and bulky. The owl being the wise of them all said, Let me explain. Heavy means it weighs a lot and mass is what makes it heavy. Mass is how much matter an object has so the watermelon is massive and because of that it has a lot of mass making it heavy and hard to lift. The other animals listened carefully and understood the difference between mass and weight. The owl then decided to explain the difference with a little interactive example. He said, let's take two objects, one is a hollow log and the other is a filled log, both are of same sizes. Now, both of these objects have different masses, the hollow log is lighter than the filled log and the reason is that it has less matter. The filled log has more matter, so it is heavier than the hollow log. Mass refers to the amount of matter in an object. The more matter an object has, the more massive it is. Weight, on the other hand, refers to the force exerted on an object by gravity. The heavier an object is, the more it weighs. Let's drop one of these leaves and this rock from the same height. All suggested, holding up a small rock she had picked up from the ground. Other animals nodded eagerly, excited to see the results. They found a nearby tree to stand on and held the leaf and rock at the same height, then let go at the same time. To their surprise, the leaf fluttered slowly to the ground, while the rock fell quickly and hit the ground with a thud. Why did the rock fall so much faster than the leaf? Rabbit asked. Owl explained that the rock had more mass than the leaf, so it experienced a stronger force of gravity pulling it towards the ground. This made it accelerate faster as it fell, so it reached the ground in less time than the leaf did. The leaf on the other hand has less mass, so it experienced a weaker force of gravity. Owl continued, this make it fell more slowly and took longer to reach the ground. Rabbit said, so mass and weight are really important when it comes to how things move. Owl nodded, exactly. The more massive something is, the more force of gravity it experiences and the faster it will fall. The animals nodded in agreement and the owl continued, now let's say we take these two objects to the moon. The weight of both objects will be less on the moon because the gravitational force on the moon is much less than that on the earth. However, the mass of both objects will remain the same because the amount of matter in them hasn't changed. They realize that even though an object may be big, it doesn't necessarily mean that it is heavy. The weight of an object depends on its mass and the gravitational force acting on it. So they decided to roll the watermelon back to their jungle and they all enjoyed the delicious fruit together. And they realized that if they ever got to go to the moon, 
They could jump really high because the weaker gravity would make them weigh less. And so, animals' curiosity had led them to a greater understanding of the world around. So my friends, keep exploring and don't forget to subscribe the channel to get more adventurous stories like this. Thanks for watching.